We do things that other people can't do. We do things that people wish they could do or are too scared to do. Like, I would play in the NFL. I would have no fear doing that. Put my shoulder pads on and being the running back, I would do it. You could go, Kurt, you want to try? Yeah, you're just hitting me. It's going to hurt, you know what I mean? But I'm a tough guy. I'm a physical type of guy. Um, you watch NFL players and they try to come in here and be MMA guys. It's do you like getting punched in the face? by another man who's training for you to punch you in the face. And if you do, are you coordinated enough to do so? Take the punch the right way. To go inside a cage in front of 30,000 people and allow another human being to punch you, kick you, knee you in the face, hit you with elbows, which will permanently defigure your face or your body or your skull for the rest of your life. That's the difference between me and other people. That's why people like, got maybe like you guys or people that are just students that want to come in here and punch and kick stuff and be around us. They want to be around because they can't do it. it and not that there's something wrong with them. We're out of, we're crazy. We are thrilled. Like people, I'll never jump out of an airplane. So when I see people like, I'm jumping out of an airplane, I'm like, wow, you, my friend, are insane. And they're like, you get punched in the face willingly for a living. I think you are. And then we both have that mutual thing. I'll never do what you do, ever. And he's like, well, I'll never do what you do, but I just can't do it. I think that's just uh, you know, that, that, that stigma of what we find is not crazy to what you guys like. Because I don't see a fan, even my father, could be in there and be like, I could do that. But then when it comes down to the fact of doing it, can you really do it? Would you really train for it? That's all the easy stuff. Can you lose the weight? Can you be disciplined not to go out and hang out with your friends? Can you, sub can you solitude yourself? And then can you walk down there and fight? And then can you hold your nerves like this as they're introducing you? And then they're like, okay, they've done my name. And then they go to you and introduce your name. And you're like, Phew. you know how they just picked you up. Now you came back down again, and now you're like, <laughs> and then they're like, all right, and they, 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 the interview guy turns around, they go out, the, and you're like, the cage shots, and the guy's like, are you ready? Like, wow, well, I was ready, like, when I walked out here, it's been like 10 minutes. That is the hardest part of fighting, I think, and once you get past that, I think there's, you know, I could do anything in life now. I could probably jump out of an airplane now.